Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Nichelle, and tonight we are going to be planning in my personal size um, planner horizontally. And we are going to go and use um, the Illuminate by Planner Gem. So this is going to be part three. And I will, I will try and remember to link part one and part two in case you want to see that. Um, so let me go ahead and just quickly show you what I have left, which is quite a bit. Um, I have, I think this was like a freebie, if I'm not mistaken, I, I don't remember. Um, but it's it's like, it's definitely for horizontal and it's probably a double box. And then you have the um, Planner Gems. She does gems instead of glitter, which I like. I love, love, love. And I've already used the green color in my recollections. And then you have your sidebar goodies your functional page. Um, I have some remaining strips that I use that I'm going to, I'm going to use in this one. I have pretty much all of the little, some washi strips left. Um, I have, I think four of, yeah, four of these quarter gem boxes because they have the little gems around them. And then I have the uh, headers and a few of the half boxes and quarter boxes left. So we are going to go ahead and get started. And I think what I'm going to do is I am going to use the remaining strips of the header of the, I'm sorry, of the washi in here. And that's typically what I do um, because it's not, this is not, um, where I place the washi in the recollections, it's not wide enough, so I do have to cut it down. And then I typically use the remaining pieces in my personal spread. So I am just going to just lay this down. I don't do anything really fancy. I don't um, typically do the sides unless I'm using a personal size planner and it has that. But normally, normally, I can't talk, normally I'll just add some little, a strip of washi going up and down um, on both sides. So I am going to cut this down just a little and probably this in here that doesn't have a whole lot of deco. And then I will go ahead and cut this into a flag and then add to the um, other side. Okay, and I normally like to do the opposite end of the flags, just because, and that's just me. And this is um, glossy, by the way, so it's not very forgiving, and I do not have undo. So if a sticker is... Um, that's what I'm looking for. If it is crooked and it doesn't start to come up easily, then it will stay there. So just FYI, I am going to do my best to keep it straight. Okay, so now um, I am going to try and lay down this full box here and see if I can just lay this across here just for deco. And it's definitely going to be um, too big. So what I think I may do, and gosh, help. All right, it's just, I should have got my cutter back out, but all right, I'm not going to stress over it and spend a ton of time on it. All right, so to calm my nerves, <laughs> I'm going to add some deco at the top because it is really cute. And if I have little pieces of deco, then I try to add it to my spreads. Okay. 
Okay. All right, there's the deco that I've added. And now what is left to do besides start to plan? Okay, so I'm just going to leave that the way it is and be done with it. Um, and I'm going to just start planning. So Monday is... Um, I have... My daughter has school, driving school, private, and practice. And so I think I am going to go with a three-heart checklist. Now, I don't do my meals in here. I, I put them in my sidebar, and you will see what I'm talking about in a few minutes once I'm done with this. Okay. And I do want to go ahead and lay down my, um, my, um, videos. So, I think I'm going to use these boxes here. Because I have a little bit more space and room to play with in here versus my A5 because I added those lines in there. So I'm trying to line this up here to where it's above that line. All right, I am going to get out my hearts from Clever Gal Crafts. I think I have some darker purple ones, I believe. I hope so because those are like my favorite. And I ordered some more and some different colors and they are just too cute. Okay, I do, yay. Okay, so I'm gonna be using these hearts here from Clever Gal Crafts. These are her open hearts and the color palette that I'm using is Flow. So I'm gonna be doing that and that is just too cute, okay. So I also have a 31 minute call that I wasn't able to track in my A5 that I think I do wanna go ahead and track in here. And so I'm just gonna be using one of these littles here to mark that. And this still gives me plenty of room to write. And I'm going to use a laptop from Planner Kate. Okay, so that is what I have going on on Monday. Tuesday, I have my leader call and she has driving school. So I am going to use I think another checklist. Okay. And then I'm going to lay down my boxes for um, my videos. And let me grab my heart. Because I love these hearts. Okay, and then I still have plenty of space if anything else come up that I can add to. Um, and then Wednesday, I don't have anything set in stone, but I do need to check to see if she has um, her, um, her tumbling, but I think that is 
I think it's Wednesday. Um, but I am just going to add a um, half box here. And then let me add my box here for my video, which is my personal. Okay. And then Thursday, I think my daughter has her tumbling on Wednesday, if I'm not mistaken. And then Thursday, I don't have anything set in stone, but I am going to go ahead and lay down this box here, which will take care of that sheet, and add down my box for my Thursday video, which is normally a 31 video, and I'm going to do my best to get those recorded for Thursday. I normally just post one, and it's just really just sharing with you um, a product, something functional that you can use in your business or at home, everyday life, things like that. Okay, so Thursday, I am going to add in a, another half box, and I'll do the, this blue one here. And let me just turn this here. Okay, and then again, if I need to write anything else in, I can always add it over here if I need to. Friday, I'm going to go in and add in one of those remaining checklists. It is the day before my son's um, um, prom, so I'm sure we're going to be having things to do for that. And then Friday is when I want to upload my... Um, I want to upload my... Um, I can't think right now. My rewind spread. And let me grab a heart. Okay. And then the 13th is definitely my son's prom. Plus me and my daughters and my sister we are going to we're going to do like a pre mothers mothers day brunch so i want to mark that and i'm thinking to just go ahead and use the remaining of this or save that for sunday um, let me go ahead and add it for, let me just add it um, I'm just going to add that here and Sunday is Mother's Day so what I think I want to do Um, let's see, you know what, I am going to use this little clipboard here, and I'm going to put this up here over here, and right in Mother's Day as best that I can. And then I am going to add the checklist for this one, only because I know I'm not cooking, first of all. Um, but Sunday is my planning day, so I do want to mark that. 
and I am going to put this planner down as well and to use up some of these right here I am going to use one of these I know I'm going to be probably filming I just don't know when so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that and then kind of do that and write planning play you know plan next week and then oh I'm sorry um I may even plan on Saturday so it just really depends so as far as filming concern um so i'm not going to mark anything just yet because i don't know my sister is coming into town well she she lives like an hour away so but i think she's coming in friday so i may not be able to start doing my filming until sunday i just don't know i may even try to start filming on thursday so i think think that's it and then I may do some cleaning on Friday but I don't want to mark it I just hate marking things that I don't know for sure um, I just don't know and I just got my nails done so I don't need to do that I was trying to go in here and see if there is anything that I need to do oh on the 10th I'm sorry the 10th is payday so I am going to mark that down. And mark that. And then I also want to pay some bills. But I can mark that in my sidebar. Okay, so let's go in and I think I'm going to go in and fill out what I need to do and I can't find my pen. I just lost my pen. Okay, let's see. All right, so Monday I have my 31 minute call. And then Haley has driving school. She has privates. And then practice. And then Tuesday is driving school. Oh, I put that backwards. Darn it. And then I have my leader call. I did that backwards. Okay, Wednesday, she has driving school. I want to say Wednesday is her tumbling and the reason why I'm struggling and trying to remember is because we started with a new gym and I'm still trying to learn their schedule her new schedule okay so that's that and then Thursday she also has driving school and Friday, she has open gym, so I'll put an X on it if she doesn't do it, because this past week she didn't go, so we'll see. Okay, and then Saturday, we're going to do a girls brunch, and then my, hu my husband, my son has his senior prom. Okay, then Mon Sunday is Mother's Day. And then plan. Since I already have the plan, I'm just going to say next week. Okay, so this is everything filled out of what I know for sure. And now we're going to go ahead and plan my used uh, uh, my sidebar so my sidebar is it just provides me with extra little things 
basically like an overall to-do list of certain things that I want to get done. I just don't know what day. That's what I use this for. Okay, so I'm going to use this washi and lay this at the top. Okay, and then I do want to put in my um, meals. I do track my meals, so let me grab that. Oh, you know what? I have an extra one. Okay, I have two of those um, weekly habit trackers, so I can use that. So let me get that out, and then I am going to do the meal plan first. I like to see the first thing that I do. Definitely want it on the first page rather. Okay, and then I'm just going to use one of these here. I am going to turn this to the side. And we're still recording, okay. All right, and then I am going to put a washi between the next one. This is a glitter header washi that they had, she had. And I'm going to put in my daughter's work schedule. up the other habit tracker weekly rather I guess you I could have put that over top there I did not see that so you can put it over top of that if you need to but I didn't I didn't catch it okay and for some reason I'm putting this way over to this it's crooked and it's not lining up right so I'm just going to trim this really quickly Okay, so that is the first half, but I think I can squeeze a habit tracker at the bottom, which I want to I want to do. And okay. So that is the first half. Now let's work on the second half, and I don't have a lot of um I don't have like I've used up all of the I've used up a bunch of stuff which I'm really happy with to be honest um, I am going to add this other habit tracker and let me add some washi at the top I mean, if I have it, I want to use it, you know? Okay, so she has here goals next week, workout to buy. Um, I really don't need any of these. So what I think I'm going to do is use this last to do. And then I'm going to pause and go get some other things that I normally put in here that she doesn't have. And I am going to use this little checkbox here that she provided. Okay, so give me one second and I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. It took me a few minutes to figure out what I was wanting to put down as well as trying to find something. I reorganized my stickers last night and so um, I kind of moved things around and 
all that good stuff. So I am going to, next I want to put down, I have some bills that I do want to pay. So I am going to, actually I can use this right here as for my bills. And how about we use one of these little pieces of washi. Okay, and then I am going to put this down. And um, I know this doesn't match because I've been doing green. Um, I mean, not green, but pink and purple. Okay, it's going to bother me if I don't find the right color. Um, let me quickly grab a short list that I can use really quick. All right, so I'm not going to worry about trying to find that. I'm just going to use this little three heart checklist from Planner Kate. And just put that down all right and then those are bills and then I wanted to put down a habit tracker which says pick up house and I'm going to break up some of that purple and add in a green and then I'm going to do a to clean and I think I'm going to go with a green as well. And that's from um, my own island. And then I want to put down any errands. And I'm going to use this pink one, the car. And that is from Planner Kate. Okay. And I was trying to think if there's anything else that I am missing. I think that's pretty much it. It's pretty standard. Um... I think, yeah, I don't think I need to put anything else. Matter of fact, I don't think I'm going to have enough space. So, therefore, I am going to use up this washi. Okay, so... This is my sidebar. If you have a personal size planner and you are looking for ways to give yourself additional space, I've got this idea from Holly Plans and I've been doing this way probably since, mm, I want to say August, I believe, and I absolutely do love it. Um, now, as far as my meal planning go, I don't, I'll write it in the day of, of what I have because things change. Like today, I was going to make fish tacos and we were out longer than we expected and we um, ate a lunch and it was heavy. So we're, we were, I'm still full, so I didn't cook dinner. So that's why I don't write in beforehand because things change. Now then, when I'm done with this, I will go in and write in my daughter's schedule. Um, I have my habit tracker here. I have another one at the top. Then I have a little to-do list. Um, the bills that I want to get paid. I don't think I have any happy mail, so sometimes I'll add in happy mail. I don't think I have any happy mail coming in this week. And then this is just for me to... Um, I like this pickup house. Um... I try to spend at least 15 to 20 minutes before I come into my office to work, either pick up in my bedroom, pick up in the living room, things like that, um, and then to clean, 
any errands I need to run. And this would be, you know, as, as the week progresses or as I'm thinking about it, oh, I need to go do this or that needs to get done or whatever. So that is it for my sidebar. I hope that is helpful for you guys. And let's go ahead and put this back in into my um, planner. And I've moved out of my Kate Spade. As you can probably see, I am now you into my pink color, color crush. So let's go ahead and put these back in. I need to cut some more of these out. Okay, so this is what it looks like inside of my planner. And I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Um, I love this little sidebar thing here. Um, like I said, it gives me additional space because as you can see, I don't have a whole lot of space to write in. So this is just mainly um, main things that I need to get done and this is overall stuff. Um, and then if I go to the post office, say on a Thursday, I'll write that in post office. I do like to write that in on the actual day that I do go. Um, so yes. So thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope you did enjoy it and got some great ideas. Um, if you're not a part of my subscription, I would absolutely love to have you hit that subscribe button so you can continue to follow with me. And this was part three of the illuminate, illuminate kit, uh, kit. I was about to say kiss. Let me show you what I do have left. I do have some of the littles left and a couple pieces of washi and I'm trying to dig them from the pile. Um, I have the headers and I have a couple of the full, the quarter boxes which I can easily go in and add during the week if I need to. And then I have pretty much all of the icons, some deco. Um, I will go in and just add, matter of fact, let me see what I can do here. Um, let's go in and add this little candlestick like right here. Okay, done, hello. You probably can't see because I have you guys zoomed out. And then um, I have some of these flags and these little flags right here. I do have a little happy mail, little mailer thing right there. If I get in happy mail that day, I'll just mark it with that. And then I do have um, the glitter headers, which I will be saving. And I think I have one more sheet that I'm trying to grab for you guys so you guys can see. And then this was the full boxes with the quarter boxes. Um, this sheet is completely gone. So um, I do like the I do like Planner Gems mini kit. Um, it did give me an idea to see how far I can stretch this. Um, there was only like a few things that I needed to bring in that she didn't have, for instance, the meal littles, um, but that wasn't a big deal. I mean, technically, I could I could have used a bunch of these and just used the little icons, and I probably would have used up majority of these. So in the near future, I will make a note of that. Um, that doesn't make make or break me with a kit. Um, and now going into as far as my recollections, I did have to bring in some checklists. Again, that's not a big deal because um, I could have easily, you know, I could have, I'm trying to think what I could have done. I guess probably nothing. So um, bringing in that is not a problem. Um, these I will save and use in a different, maybe like a rewind spread or something. I, I'm going to try and bring these in. At the near, you know, as the week progresses, uh, progresses, uh, do the same thing with these. If not, I mean, seriously, these are some solid colors to where I can always bring in. So this was a great kit. I don't have a lot, lot left over. I don't have enough to use for a rewind spread, which is good. That's a good thing. Um, but 
I love her kits. I think I have one more. I have to go back and double check. But I am going to go in and add in the um, coffee since it is Coffee Monday. And Mondays are always the hardest. So I did that. And I think that is pretty much it. Like I said, I can bring in some other things once the week progresses, some different icons. And I'll sit down tonight or tomorrow morning and start filling out these things right here. So again, guys, thank you guys so much. Um, I hope you did enjoy it. And I will try and remember to link my um, A5 and my recollection so you can see what I used out of there. And I will go in and write in um make sure I make a note of anything that I that was not a part of the kit from a different shop I will go in and write those in for you as well so until next time I hope you guys have a wonderful wonderful evening and a wonderful week and I'll see you in my next video bye